what can you say about the way the team kind of came out in the second half? Uh, looked a little bit flat. Uh, you guys couldn't really capitalize on your chances. Uh, it was a pretty close game, I think. We had a few opportunities, and uh, like I said before, uh, those kind of games, you have to be efficient. I don't think we were efficient enough in the, in the third part. Um, and, and like you see, sadly for us, those kind of games, they get this decided on set pieces, and uh, that's what I did today. You, you guys are one six and three at home. Can you believe that? No, I mean I can. It's the reality, so yeah, I, I believe it. But it's hard. But, uh, I know. Yeah, it's 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 strange. It's like I said, it's it's been a funny season. It's a strange season up to now, and we had ups and downs, but we had a little bit too much ups and downs, and. So I think uh, I just want to focus on the good things. The focus players are coming back, players getting back fit again. So um, I mean, a few weeks ago we only had 15 players to go on the road game. So, um, so it's a good thing. Experienced guys coming back and getting fit again and, and, and bringing them in. And, and now we have to just move on. It's a good thing there's another game Saturday, so we can move on and uh, um, to the next game and have to stick our heads together and. Uh, get out of this situation. Yeah, we just started the second half of the season and this is a team that you could have jumped over with a win tonight. How soon do you guys start looking at the standings and the points and all that as you make a playoff push here? I don't think we have to focus too much on the standings. Um, like you just like you said, it's it's halfway the season so uh, there's enough games to 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 uh, work that out. So we have to look at it game by game I think. What are your thoughts on Ashley Cole in that midfield position? One of the big pluses seems to be he gets a lot, he sees a lot more of the ball. Yeah, and, and, and he asks the ball, so he doesn't hide or whatever, so I think he did well. How do you keep, when you talk about changing uh, the focus and moving on, as the captain, how do you keep this team from putting their heads down after you know, the performances at home? I think, first of all, by not putting your, health, your head down yourself. Uh, so um, just move on. Tomorrow is another day, and then now we have to be focused already on the Saturday game. Um, it's all about region now. The coming, the coming up, the coming days. So we travel tomorrow. It's going to be a nice flight. So um, turf field. So Saturday is all about mentality, I think. Do you think that the team plays with energy throughout, or do you think at some point you guys just kind of get a little defeated and discouraged? Excuse me. Do you think that you played with energy throughout the entire game as a team, or do you think at some point the team kind of starts to get a little defeated or discouraged? Mm, I don't understand the question. Like, do you think that you play with energy? You personally, do you think you play with energy throughout the entire game, or that at some point does the pressure kind of get to you and the rest of the guys? No, I mean, I think first of all, uh, Honestly, I can say I didn't play my best game, I think. Um, I played better, personally. But, um, I mean, you have to go through it. I mean, if you see the goal, it's, it was my, my man. I used to, I had to mark him, so it's my responsibility, so I'll, I'll take that. Um, it was just a misjudgment, I think. Uh, I ran with him, and at one point I stopped, because I thought Brian was coming, but Brian was shouting away. So it's, it's, it's my responsibility, so... Uh, um, but that's the way it goes in life. Ups and downs, personal, as, as for myself, as for the team. And uh, like I said, I take it and uh, just move on.